Here we have a very very simple and nice question. We're going to find out the multiplicative inverse of negative of iota. Well, let me suppose this is my complex number minus iota and multiplicative inverse of this uh, complex number z, we write generally z inverse is equals to 1 over z and that's 1 over negative of iota and I'm going to uh, I'm going to multiply and divide by the conjugate of this iota as we used to do, right? Uh, I'm doing by the manual way, you know, by, by normal way. You can use the shortcut methods also or you can use the formula to find out the multiplicative inverse uh, of any any uh, thing and here also you can do the same. So it is iota over negative of iota square and it's iota, it's minus and an iota square, everybody know my dear friend, that is minus 1. So it's going to be i over plus 1, that's simply iota. So the multiplicative inverse of negative of iota is simply the positive iota. Or here if you want to say in this case particularly, it's just a conjugate of that, right? You can go with this way also, Mul uh, multiplicative inverse of z is uh, z conjugate of z divided by absolute value of z square. Alright, so conjugate of z, it's uh, minus i, so it will be simply plus i, and uh, the absolute value of z is uh, simply the square of the imaginary part plus square of the real part, alright, under root that, so it's under root square of, uh, you know, this you can turn like 0 plus minus 1 iota, so real part is here 0, imaginary part is here minus i, so it's 0 square, you, if you want then you can write, if you don't want then you can leave it also, alright, that's not necessary to write this, and plus minus 1 whole square. So it's iota over 1 inside the root, simply it's iota directly, like this you can also write. This is the formula to find out the molecular inverse of any uh, any, any type of uh, complex number, alright. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.